Hey guys, it's Postbox Pat, and welcome back to a brand new Fortnite Battle Royale storyline video. And today we're going to be talking about a meteoric rise and also so much more information regarding the brand new scientist skin, which you can see on screen right now, the whole storyline behind the scientist skin, and obviously the meteoric rise channels. So, this is really cool. I think we've got something major today, some major storyline information. Is it going to be the visitor versus the scientist? What is going on? Well, let's break it down because, first off, we're not actually in any in game footage just yet before we jump into some replay mode i will show off some things on here which is very important so when i actually click on this skin look at the description his mission is unknown one of the seven the scientist part of the visitor set so the visitor set has just been added in today and this is something which is very interesting seeing that one of the seven what does that mean guys also take a look at the challenges themselves we do also have a bunch of other stuff we have the star surge bat bling power through the rifts it says so that again is a huge huge game changer this guy has a rocket on his back which can teleport him through different portals which is insane we also have the challenge description here which tells us that you have to search the pod in the meteor so did he come out of the pod we're going to be discussing that in today's video as well if you guys are new around here smash that subscribe button it'd be absolutely awesome if you could do that hit that big red button down below and stay tuned for daily map changes storylines and information videos on fortnite battle royale also go and enter in code postbox pat i'm going to be gifting a bunch of people a bunch of stuff in the upcoming videos make sure you're entering in your epic games name down below and also put a constructive comment with it and i will be hiding a little secret thing in the video as well which you guys can comment and add that in there to give you guys a good chance of getting gifted a skin all right so what have we got in here which i can go over as well so if i go over to the actual screen where the visitor is himself you can see me using him here and again on him it says one of the seven intentions unknown so what is going on with this visitor stuff there's now two visitors out of seven or is it the same person is it his brother is it his enemy has he created this skin who knows exactly what is going on right there we also have the visitor bat bling which i want to go over as well let me just locate it in here because i've got so many bat blings it's almost impossible to keep track of every single one but here it is this is the off-world rig and this is an intergalactic uh, original which it says right there so quite a cool bat bling and this one to me looks like some sort of phone and now we have the brand new star surge bat bling which again is part of the visitor set this one hasn't had its name changed though has the visitor had its name changed let's have a little look has it no it hasn't so that is interesting so are we going to get the other six, uh, five versions of the visitor in the item shop maybe this is quite an interesting thing to know because these aren't part of the visitor set but this is so this is such a big big change guys we're gonna have to pop in game and break this down a little bit more so let's go and pop into a replay haven't already smash a like on today's video let's try and get over 10,000 likes it's a massive goal but if every single one of you watching this video right now hits that like button you're going to help the video get out to as many people as possible so they can understand the storyline behind the visitor one and the scientist Okay, so we are now in the replay mode and it's time to break down the information that we have regarding the scientist and the visitor. Are they battling against each other or are they working together to create the brand new event slash rocket? It's a huge question and it's something that I've been talking to myself about probably for the last 30 minutes trying to work out what is going on guys. Like, how do we even know where this is going to take us? So, what I've come up with is a few different points to kind of have a little stab at and kind of guess exactly where we are at. So first off, I want to talk about the pod. So the pod itself, did the visitor come out of this pod? Now, this is a great question. Who exactly came out of this pod? So originally, I thought it was the classic visitor, which we have on the map today. And you can see that here from Epic Games' tweet, where they actually tweeted out a picture of the classic visitor dismantling the mech. So this kind of references that he did return during that meteor. However, there's now another thought in my head saying, maybe he didn't return in that meteor. He was already on the map with the rocket launch. He didn't even leave the map, guys. He's been on the map the entire time. And maybe this is the other visitor, the second one, who's appeared in this meteor. As we know, guys, everything in this season is really messed up. We've seen, for example, Dusty Divot be completely different colours. We know exactly how the colours have been completely changed. We've seen so many things go random. For example, we've seen a cube return out of nowhere. We've seen tacos fall from the sky. Everything seems to come back, but it doesn't seem to be the same. Now, with the meteor, is that the same thing? The meteors come back. 
However, rather than being the original visitor, it's now visitor 2.0. And did this visitor 2.0 have some sort of relationship to calling in the max? Maybe he did. So that's something to note as well. And that's maybe why the visitor 1.0 is re or deconstructing the max to try and gather some information to take out the other visitor which has recently joined us one of seven now the symbol on the mech here doesn't seem to relate to the symbol on the scientist i've kind of searched the entire scientist on the actual locker screen and i don't see this symbol related to him at all but we know the visitor has his own symbol on his arm so this is something to note and something that's quite interesting because maybe it's not related and maybe he is working with the visitor quite an interesting topic right there and something which we're going to dive a little bit more into in a second so the next one i want to talk about is did the visitor build this suit as his secondary suit now that is a high possibility maybe that is what he's done the scientist could just be the same person underneath this mask right here whoever it is it could be the same person building the next skin so it's just like another variant obviously they've allowed it to be a brand new skin because no one really has access to the visitor and apparently currently the skin is free for anyone if you don't even own the battle pass that may be a glitch but currently it is so the visitor itself maybe have cra has crafted this suit for himself to teleport through the rifts as we saw before the description of the brand new battling is talking about teleporting and flying through the rifts so maybe that has a reference to the visitor crafting a new suit or it could have a reference to the new visitor appearing through one of these rifts that we just don't we don't know which one he's appeared through but he could have just popped in and he's come either to help or destroy the visitor we don't know or join him who knows exactly so is he part of his family that kind of does make sense because we know from what we've seen he's one of the seven is the scientist part of the family of the visitor potentially he could be part of the family but it's quite hard to know at this moment in time we just can't really tell the skins are very similar they both have similarities for example they even have the little dagger on them and they all have very similar design so it's quite an interesting concept and something that we definitely need to kind of think about before we dive deep into this it's something that is going to be crazy guys when it takes place so do consider this event is going to be absolutely insane we could see them even mention it in the challenges they mentioned meteor they mentioned cube and they mentioned the rift slash orb at loot lake they've mentioned them in that challenge guys the challenge right here at the very bottom the brand new challenges the a meteoric rise they've mentioned it you can see there you've got the the rift above loot lake you've got the giant cube and you've obviously got the landing pod within the meteor now the idea of a meteoric rise the word meteoric actually means fast and uprising so basically a meteor that flies so fast you can barely even see it it's often used to describe upcoming musical artists when they make it to the charts very very quickly now that in fortnite maybe they're describing this guy is going to cause so much madness on the map during the event brand new map changes will pop up everywhere the whole fortnite map will become a brand new map now i know many of you guys commented on yesterday's video saying how this fortnite map that we're looking at right now will not actually change into a new map now when i say a new map i think they will what you're trying to say there is that the island is not going to get wiped and it's not going to be a new island that's basically what you're trying to say that is perfectly correct guys the island's still going to stay the same they're just going to put brand new point of interests on and wipe probably 100 percent of it but it'll still be the same shape and it'll still be the same island it'll still have the same spawn island everything will still be the same it'll just be the new map basically maybe anyway we don't 100 percent know if that's going to be the case but we can assume that most point of interests could get changed during this crazy event because it is season 10 at the end of the day so many things have glitched and messed up we're gonna have to see what is going to happen with this one guys it's gonna be crazy now the next bit i want to talk about is if he is the enemy of the visitor what is he doing here and what is his plan well we know that the visitor has deconstructed the mech and what we can gather from this he's managed to grab all the parts from all the rift beacons that he's been creating to rebuild his rocket to cause something with this rocket ideally he's probably trying to escape the planet but last time he tried doing that and it just ended completely wrong maybe he's trying to do the same again but he's probably a little bit confused he's actually been gathering his power from the rift beacon over here as i talked in yesterday's video how the monster could potentially return highly recommend checking it out guys potentially now this rift beacon over here he knows that this orb beacon whatever you want to call it rift has a major impact 
in the Fortnite world. It's part of the cube's power. He knows that he can use that to fight, to create, to cause, to change the entire world. We don't know 100% which one of them it's going to be. And is he going to battle this new scientist skin? I don't know. The word scientist to me feels a little friendly for it. The visitor itself feels kind of friendly as well. The visitor himself actually was a visitor at one point, as we know, with Dusty Divot, which was in this location right here. He actually ended up there built a rocket and it escaped but it went a little bit wrong and is the scientist here to fix it all because he's a scientist or is he here to mess it up even further great questions being asked there great theories but that's everything for today's video let me know down in the comment section down below what you think is going to happen with the visitor versus the scientist some crazy information going around in the fortnite community right now and this is amazing news the skin is available right now guys so make sure you go and grab it it's actually one of my favorite skins i'm 100 going to be using it as soon as this update is over well it's not even an update it's already live so go and grab it guys go and grab the skin i'm going to be using it and you guys should too if you don't already own the visitor as well it's definitely worth a cop however the visitor also has that one of the seven so there's five others out there are we going to get them this season are we going to see them throughout the fortnite storyline as in kind of like a villain type thing a little bit like borderlands they have a certain kind of race which is got this ability where there can only be five of them at once are we going to see that with the visitor where we're going to be leading up to say season 10 what season 10 season like 20 season 30 and we're still going to be on like the fourth or the fifth version of this visitor character maybe it's going to be really exciting i can't wait to see what's coming in the future this is going to be awesome guys keep up to date with the channel smash that subscribe button i've got some amazing information and news videos coming very soon for you guys so stay tuned for all them i hope you guys have enjoyed and once again this is postbox part signing out